Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Fallout New Vegas. Um, yeah, let's just get right into it. Uh, no introduction needed. We uh, are going to actually post multiple videos of this back to back to back, so probably won't have to talk about where I left off or what's been going on. If you're watching them, you're watching them and you know. Well, that was quite an adventure. We taught those convicts a thing or two, didn't we? Breaking myself out of a hostage situation. <laughs> Not to diminish your Breaking myself out of a hostage situation? Thrilling. Problem is, there's still no law in print. What are we to do the next time ruffians menace us and hold us hostage? Let's see, uh... What are you talking about? You're the sheriff now. Oh, no. I'm just a deputy. I can't be a deputy without a sheriff. It's called chain of command. Okay... Um You will. That's just marvelous. I'll start thinking up questions for the interview. The sheriff that was incarcerated up at NCRCF may be a good choice. You also may be able to convince that NCR guy across the road to take the town under his wing. Although martial law doesn't sound so fun. Alright, so um Bring new sheriff back. Well, that's probably not what I'm gonna do right now. That's something I guess I'll come back and do. Um, like I said, I've played this game multiple times, so I kind of want to do things a little bit different than I normally do. Because um, I've seen the endings a couple different ways, you know. And every time you, at the end of the game, when you uh, accomplish different tasks, it talks about it and you know has different things to say about what's going on. So. I don't want to do any of those, so I think I just want to stick to the main quest right now. Alright. God, the loading in this game is quite extensive sometimes. Alright guys, so I guess I'm going to start heading towards Novak. Um, it's quite a long trip there. I have to make it from here to here. So um, I'm actually probably going to stop up here first though because I need to sell some more stuff because I'm pretty sure I'm still pretty loaded up on shit. So... Yeah, um, I'm going to go ahead and start making the trek, and I'll be back with you guys as soon as I get there. So uh, on my way up to Novak, I see some guys up here, so I thought I'd just turn back on the camera for this part. There we go. Now, if I remember correctly, there is more people up here, so we might as well go ahead and uh, put this on camera because, I mean, let's face it, some of the best parts of the game is the fight. Oh, damn it. You know what? Maybe I will leave this part. I really need to sell some more stuff, honestly, or get rid of some crap. I have so much stuff, but it's so hard to want to drop this stuff because... Money is so gosh dang important in this game. Oh, uh, let's see. I could free up a little bit of stuff, I guess. Alright. You know what? I'm just going to go ahead and uh, leave this for now. And, uh,. Yeah, I'll be back with you guys here shortly. Or not. I thought I might be able to sneak by these guys, but apparently not. Did you just die. Thank you. Guys, you're one tough bitch. You know what? I'm just going to get rid of some shit. What is 
is the cheapest stuff? Give me that, 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 that. Here we go. Alright guys, now those guys are taken care of, um, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and uh, continue my trek. I'm not going to worry about going in there right now. Um, I'll probably hit that up sometime later. I don't know, I was kind of thinking about it after, you know, I might actually want to finish this quest off and get the town up and running as fast as possible. I don't know, we'll see, I haven't decided yet. So I'll be back with you guys in a minute. Alright, so I'm here at the Mojave Outpost. Um, they got quite the nice little statue going on here. We got two NCR people shaking hands. In the year 2271, the Desert Rangers of Nevada and Rangers of New California Republic meet at this spot to sign the Ranger Unification Treaty. Under this treaty, the Desert Rangers agree to be Absorbed in the NCR in exchange for NCR's protection of Hoover Dam, New Vegas, and Southern Nevada against the forces of Caesar's Legion. All right. What are you doing, bud? Coming from the north? Must be crazy to brave those roads. Um, any work? Nothing I know of. But if you come from the north, means you can travel freer than most around here. Might check the barracks. Someone might need you to hoof it somewhere. Just be careful you go up on the roof. Got a sniper watching the road. If your gear's in need of repair, HQ's also worth checking out. Talk to Major Knight, he can help. Provided you got a pen and plenty of ink. Alright, um... I'll be going now. That's enough for you. First things first, I do know there's a store in here, so I'm going to go ahead and sell all my stuff. New face in the outpost. Must have come from the north. So, what do you have? Um, any work? Work around here. Might check with Jackson in the main building. Or ghost up on the roof above, but watch out. She's... Well, she's kind of a bitch. <laughs> Don't tell her I said that, though. Might take uh, a bullet some night when I'm going to the latrine. That's the first thing I'm going to tell her. Um, trade. Take a look. Ooh, a thousand dollars she has. So let's go ahead and uh, clear out all that. Uh, that... And stim packs. I mean, let's face it, you need lots of stim packs in this game. Alright. So, I'm going to go ahead and finish doing my selling and then uh, yeah I'll be right back with you. Alright so I'm done selling all my stuff 
And now I guess I'm going to look for some more work. Which I'm pretty sure this is the guy you talked to. Looks like we got a new visitor in the old Brahmin pen. Not many people coming here in a hurry. Only passing through. And if you're passing through, you picked a bad time. Road north has gone to hell. If I let a caravan through, they won't make it. Soldiers, no. Recruits, yes. And the Mojave outpost has been ordered to have a standing force at the NCR perimeter at all times. So sending anyone out reduces the outpost's numbers and would be in direct violation of my orders from back west. Alright, um, you sound frustrated. Frustrated? No, I have my orders. Signed and approved all the way up the chain from Kimball. I understand the reasons. The outpost isn't a legion target, yet. Not like Vegas or the Dam. But if the caravans get choked here, that's gonna bite NCR hard. Anyway, didn't mean to talk your ear off. Some days, just feel like more requisition forms and daily reports come across my desk than results. Um, anyway, can I help? Help? Now, look, I appreciate... Uh, you know what? Yes, I could use the help. You look like you can handle yourself. I need to get the caravans moving again. That means clearing a path north. There's too much crawling the asphalt up the road to allow it. Thanks, I appreciate it. Come back here when you're done. I might accidentally lose some supplies to <laughs> Lose some supplies. Alright. Quest added. Can you find it in your heart? Probably not, but I'm still going to do it anyways. And I think I just have to talk to the sniper, and then I could uh, go ahead and push on out of here. Wait, no, I think she's up here. I don't know where I'm going. Hello, ghost. Uh, you a Holy shit, you're pasty. This might be your lucky day, if you don't mind walking a bit. And your eyes are good. I think there's trouble in Nipton. No traffic from there on the roads. And while I can explain that away, smoke from the town I can't. I'm sure it's been hit. What I need to know is if they survived it. Might be powder gangers with all that smoke in the air. If there's anybody left, they'd be in the Nipton town hall. Go there. Check it out. Let me know what you find. Um, I'll do it. All right. Look at you. All fired up and ready to go. Wish the others around here had that kind of attitude. <laughs> Listen, I don't want you getting killed for this. So if you head there and run into trouble, I'm asking for eyes and ears, not your life. Alright? Um... So, I'm pretty sure you don't really get paid for this, but it is good experience. Um, not all quests in this game do you make money from but experience is its own reward and also you know there is the barter system you do keep what you find so there is money for that let's see so I'm gonna go ahead and try to do both these quests in the same trip because they're not that far from each other Let's go. I wish you could run in this game. I wonder if, I'm pretty sure they're adding running in the next one, but for some reason Fallout equals no running. Alright, so here's the first quest. And it is just killing a bunch of ants. Holy shit, that's bad. I really need a better gun. At least they're not fire ants. 
ugly fucker. Can I not shoot between that? few more up here you do get the service rifle which is a little bit better than this one and it's uh an automatic so well it's not automatic it's just a uh semi-automatic but there's not bolt action so it makes it almost like an automatic let's see I'm gonna bust out the pistol. All right, so now that I'm done with that, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, push up a little bit farther and see what's up with the town that she wants me to take a look at up here in Nipton should probably put my gun away do move a little faster without a weapon So many ants up here. You can't spend the time to. Whoa! Hey! I wasn't doing anything. You know what? Take that. And that. Yeah, well, now you lost your dinner, bitches. That's what you deserve. I was just trying to walk by nice and peaceful like, and you want to go ahead and come freaking running at me all crazy style. is a dangerous place, that's for sure. I feel like I'm cheating because I kind of know what's going to happen all the time and I wish I didn't. You know, that's why I can't wait for Fallout 4 because then everything will be brand new again. Get wrecked. All right. You for fuck with me. Okay. Um, me personally, repair guns are always the some of the first things I do. Lock picking. Also, I usually try to get high because, um, I mean, let's face it. If you get to a, uh, you know, you go search a place and there just happens to be something that you can't get into 
Then you have to remember where that place is and then come back to it later, which is kind of hard sometimes. And usually when things are very high, that means um, there's going to be something really good in it. Let's see. Um, I am going to take intense training one more time just so I can get my uh, intelligence up to 10, which will give me max skill points every level from here on out. So, which is something I like to have. Um, you know, it really helps with getting things as high as you can get them. I do know there's some things to go ahead and grab around here. frag grenades good stuff good stuff and for those of you that don't know and have played this game and are thinking you know maybe I'm gonna play it again too the, sh the mayor of Nipton has made a deal with the uh, legion which you'll see in a minute and it goes wrong but if you go through the mayor's house you find notes and he stashed little uh, getaway bags and there's one of the getaway bags right there that he stashes. The other one is at the gas station up there. But it's got so many rad scorpions and huge ass crazy scorpions that I'm just not tough enough to do it right now. And more than likely I'll get killed. So I just don't want to deal with it right now. And this stuff isn't that great actually. I mean there's a couple good things for the beginning of the game. But I do kind of have a method to the way I do things and... You know, by the time I get to Vegas, I'm sitting on a couple good weapons, you know, and then I start getting better stuff from there, from the Gun Runners Association. Alright, so welcome to Nipton. The Legion has fucked everybody up here, by the way. Look at it burn. Wait, I, just, I missed something here. That's right. Did you see that? No, I did not see that. I'm gonna go ahead and kill this guy. I know it seems kind of rude, but uh, the point of killing him is for these. He has uh, seven star ball caps. And I actually didn't see the fight going on, so I'm not sure where the girl died, but she actually has some too, and I totally just spaced that off while I was talking to you guys. So I'm going to see if I can find her real quick, because she has some on her, and you need, I don't know how many star caps you need to get the thing. Here she is. Yeah, she has two on her. I'm not sure how many you need to get to the uh, special weapon from the guy but uh you know it's all part of the trip you gotta collect everyone you can and there is what nine more for my collection i think it's i don't know i think the most i've ever had was like 82 and it still wasn't enough This guy's a fucking idiot. Um. What lottery? The lottery. That's what lottery. Are you stupid? Only lottery that matters. Oh, oh my God! Smell that air! <laughs> Oliver Swank, Swanick. You're screwed, buddy. What good the lottery do you? Because now you're dead anyway, so. Alright, so. Now, for those of you that don't know, this is what the Legion does. They pretty much crucify 
and kill everybody and then whoever they don't crucify they take as slaves and the legion look they're like uh, based off of Roman soldiers pretty much That is fucking wicked. Yes, and herded them to the center of town. I told them their sins, the foremost being disloyalty. I told them that when legionaries are disloyal, some are punished, the others made to watch. And I announced the lottery. Each clutched his ticket, hoping it would set him free. Each did nothing, even when loved ones were dragged away to be killed. See, I've never played on the Legion side. I just can't bring myself to do it because in all reality, I'm not an evil person. And I feel like they're very, very evil. Like, they're the worst of the evils. Like, like the NCR is kind of, I mean, they're not evil per se, but they only care about themselves. So it's kind of evil. They don't care about the people. But, I mean, the Legion's pretty damn evil, so... It's hard to want to play for them. Alright. I'm not ready to deal with these guys yet, so... Alright, so I've pretty much accomplished both my tasks. So I'm going to go back and collect my rewards. And get the things that I need from the guys. And then do a little bit more selling of inventory. And then I'll be back with you guys to uh, make the trip to Novak. Alright guys, so we are about halfway to Novak. Um, I just wanted to show you this part. Show you what the Legion does and talk about this a little bit. Just so you guys know, there are an infinite amount of these caravans. So if you are short on money and you don't mind losing a little bit of karma, you can just hit them up and kill them and take their stuff to sell. Um, but I just want to show you a little bit about the Legion for those who don't know the game. And we just happened to get an NCR squad at the same time as this caravan. This guy's going all on, off on his own. But the Legion does love to raid caravans. I'm just going to kind of stand back and uh, loot the dead bodies after they're done. This caravan is kind of lucky because sometimes there is random NCR patrols and they just happen to run into them at the same time. So the Legion did kind of get their asses kicked this time. And this game also, you uh, depending on what kind of outfit you're wearing, you can sneak and be friends with certain people. You know, so if I was to put on a Legion outfit, I could go hang out with the Legion people and get away with it. And if I was to put on NCR stuff, you know, I could get away with being an NCR person. Ooh, re here, I'm going to change that. Oh. 
Well, I guess not right now because I can't make it better. Actually, you know what? I am going to change it anyways. Let's see what kind of uh, stuff. Oh, machetes. The Legion does give lots of machetes and lots of uh, throwing spears. Um, when you start going up against like the higher level Legion people, then uh, you start getting other things too. What is this? Is this another guy over here? Oh, it's one of the bright followers. It's a zombie. Alright, so I just wanted to show you that. I am about halfway there though, so I will be there soon. Alright guys, so we're almost to Novak. Um, I thought this would be a good place to come back. Um, this right here is a ranger station. One of many that are stationed throughout the desert here all over the pass um it's where the hey hey ugly fucking thing i hate the mole rats they're so damn ugly look at that ugly fucking guy You're such an ugly fucking ugh. get your head out of here Alright, anyways, um, now these are where the p patrols that you'll see throughout the Mojave are sent from. Um, you know, I think I've never done the main quest for Mr. House, so I think maybe I'm going to go ahead and do... Oh, there's no back. You can tell by the big giant dinosaur. It's kind of weird. Give me that helmet. Um, anyways, yeah, you can tell Novak by uh, the big giant dinosaur dinky. Now, this is one of the first places where you can uh, purchase a home, which is what I'm going to do. And I'm going to make this my main base of operations for now. Um, because I need to uh, start stocking up my sas Sunset Sarsaparilla bottles. Excuse me. Um, I don't want to just sit there and keep carrying them. I think right now I have like 40 of them. Which is like a pound a piece. So that's quite a bit of weight. Um, here's a doctor's office. They're usually walking around half the time. I think she's right up there. Um, and this is also where you get... Your first follower of the game, which is one of my favorite followers, Boone. So I'm going to go ahead and do that too, get Boone. I'm going to go ahead and buy my first house, which is actually pretty cheap. I'm pretty sure she only charged you $100 for it. So let's go ahead and talk to her and purchase my house, and then I'll go ahead and get my first follower, and then we'll go ahead and push on. Um, we haven't met yet. Oh, what am I doing? I got to thinking about making a good impression and Blaine forgot to tell you my name. I'm Jeannie May. I take care of folks here at the motel, long as they aren't troublemakers. Um, what is this place? We're in a little desert oasis, name of Novak. This is the Dino Delight Motel, and it's mine. The Dino Delight Motel. Um, let's ask her if she's seen the man in the checker coat. Well, he might have been wearing a fancy outfit, but he wasn't any kind of gentleman to me. Had his nose stuck so high in the air you couldn't see it above the clouds. City folk, they always think they deserve better than what they got. Those hoodlums he was with seemed to know Manny for some reason. He's our daytime sniper up in the dinosaur's mouth. Let's see, um, I'd like to rent a room. Well, I think that's a fine idea. I'll give you a good flat rate, and you can stay as long as you like. At least until the busy season comes. Sound good? Yeah, 
Hunter caps. There you I'm go. Glad you can stay with us. Your room will be the one upstairs, closest to the lobby side. Here's your key. Let me know if there's anything I can do to make your stay better for you. Um. Okay. I'm done talking to you for now. Alright, so now it's time to uh, check out our nice fancy motel room. And here's uh, Creepy Victor following me around. Howdy, partner. Well, butter my butt and call me a biscuit if it ain't my old friend from Good Springs. That's the robot that pulled me out of the grave after I was shot. What are you doing? I don't rightly know. Just got the notion to make my way to New Vegas. Reckon I'll find out when I get there. Um, I don't really feel like talking to you right now. You're kind of annoying, anyways. All right, so this is my lovely first room, first house. Um, really, I kind of use this place throughout the whole game because uh, to get to the houses you get later on, you have to pass through a bunch of uh, load spots. So it kind of makes it frustrating to want to uh, go there all the time. And here's just a quick fast travel and you're there. Um, yeah, so there's plenty of places to, uh, you know, rest your feet, whatever, store your gear, everything you got to do in the game. So what I like to do is clean out the fridge here, and then uh, I store all my uh, stuff that I want to store. If I'm playing on hardcore mode, I would store food and stuff here, but since I'm not, I'm just going to store my uh, Sunset Sarsaparillas, which is 37 pounds, so go ahead and store that. Um, I usually like to get about 100 of them, and then I'll sit there and drink every single one of them and see how many caps I get of the uh, star caps and this is usually where I store my weapons that I don't want to take with me right now but for right now I'm pretty much selling everything that I'm not carrying so I'm not really worrying about that too much and this is where I usually store my armor that I don't want to carry around right at the time and right now like I said I don't really want to worry about that too much right now either because I don't have that much stuff and here's where I store gold and stuff, if I, or caps, not gold, if I want to store stuff. Let's see. So yeah, um, I'm not going to sleep right now. I'm just going to go ahead and move on and get my uh, NPC for me. And you'll find Boone on the night shift inside the uh, dino, Dinky the dino here. And Boone, he's pretty awesome, man. He's a sniper, so you get a perk where anything you're aiming at lights up red if they're bad. And, uh... How you doing? You just get bit by a mosquito there, dude. Welcome to the dino bite kitchen. And he's a he's a sniper, and you give him a sniper rifle, and he pretty much kicks ass, dude. Sever, he is an ex-NCR person, so if you do anything against the NCR, he'll just leave, because he'll be pissed off at you. And just so you know, every NPC person has a special quest, and you have to like get them to trust you more and more to get them to tell you what they want to do. Well, there's T-Rex figurines, of course. That's our bread and butter. We also have an assortment of the Repcon factory souvenirs, rockets, things of that nature. Alright, so I'm Come not going to sell my stuff right now. I'm just going to go ahead and uh, wait a couple more hours till Boone's on shift, which he should be now because there's Manny. And 
There he is. God damn it. Don't sneak up on me like that. What do you want? Um, uh, just looking around. There's nothing up here. There's a sniper. I think you better leave. Okay. Just make a friendly conversation, I don't buddy. I have friends here. Well, I'm not from here. No. No, you're not, are you? Maybe you shouldn't go. Not just yet. Why is that? I need someone I can trust. You're a stranger. That's a start. Um, what do you want me to do? I want you to find something out for me. I don't know if there's anything to find, but I need someone to try. My wife was taken from our home by Legion slavers one night while I was on watch. They knew when to come, what route to take, and they only took Carla. Someone set it up. I don't know who. You're trying to track down your wife? My wife's dead. I want the son of a bitch who sold her. Um, what do I do for find this person? Bring him out in front of the nest here while I'm on duty. I work nights. I'll give you my NCR beret to put on. It'll be our signal so I know you're standing with him. And I'll take care of the rest. I need to do this myself. Um, I'll see what I can do, buddy. Good. No one in town knows that I know what happened to my wife. Best they never know. When the Legion will be after me next. Alright, how do you know your wife's dead? I know, alright. That's all you need to know. Alright, buddy. So, I'm just gonna go straight to what I need to do. Um, normally, if you didn't know, you'd have to spend the time investigating to uh, figure out who took his wife, but I already know. So, I'm just gonna go straight to where I could get the information. And then I'll go grab the person. I don't want to give it away in case you don't know. Woo! So all you need to do is just go ahead and go right back into here. As soon as she leaves, I probably don't even have to wait for her to leave, honestly. I could just do it right now. You just break into this safe right here. Go ahead, take all the stuff, and there's a bill of sale right there. And if you just go to the notes real quick, um, let's see, where are they? Over here? No? Where are the notes at? Miscellaneous. Bill of Sale. So if you read through this Bill of Sale, it tells you that she is the one that sold him to the Legion. So I want to go talk to her real quick. I hope you're finding everything to your liking. And go down until you see, come with me. There's something I want to show you in front of the dinosaur. Okay, if that's what you think. I'm going to go ahead and click on this real quick, too. So we're going to go ahead and take a little trip right over here to the front of the dinosaur. Tra la 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 la. I love this part. Come on, lady. Let's go. She has a tendency to take a minute, so we'll just uh, go ahead and be right back as soon as she's there. All right, so she's there, so now I want to go ahead and put on Boone's beret and Boone. What are you doing, Boone? You're not gonna shoot her. Let's try this one more time. Come on, Boone. Shoot her in the head. Boom. My God. Dude. What are you doing? There we go. Jeannie Mae? Got your brains blown out. 
All right, so now I'll go ahead and uh, go back and talk to Boone again. First, though, I do want to grab these uh, Sunset Sarsaparilla bottles on that quest for the uh, special weapon. So now that I've uh, accomplished this for Boone, I just convince him to come with me and then I'll have my first follower. And it really helps for the rest of the trip, especially, you know, now that I all have a follower, I can start kicking the crap out of the Legion every time I see him. Because the more you beat their ass, the more upset they get with you. And so the more they start attacking you and then they start sending out like uh, hit squads to kill you all the time. That's it then. How did you know? I found the bill cell. I guess I shouldn't be surprised. It'd be like that to keep paperwork. Here. This is all I can get. I think our dealings are done here. Um what will you do? I don't know. I won't be staying, I know that. Don't see much point in anything right now, except hunting legionaries. Maybe I'll wander. Like you. Come with me. Let's go after the Legion. Um, well, here you could use your intelligence, which I think does give you experience. Yeah. Or maybe not. Working on your own, you're a lot less effective. I've been there and paid for it. But this isn't going to end well. Fine. Let's so that's the perk that he gives me for being with me. Um, let's see... What do I want to raise? I'm gonna take that to 50. Alright Boone, ready to go buddy? Alright, so I'm gonna go uh, get rid of some stuff I don't want and then um, you know, the quest tells me to uh, come here to figure out where they went so I could either talk to Manny Vargas and what he'll do is give me a quest but if you just break into his motel room and hack his computer then you can find out which way to go but me I don't have to do either of those right now um, I probably will talk to him just to get the quest because I like his quest but I'm not going to do it now because I'm on my way to Vegas and I want to make that trip so I can start opening it up. Because once you get to Vegas, then you got more guns available to you. So, and as you level up, the guns get better and the, you know, the uh, attachments for the guns. So that's kind of what I'm trying to get to and do right now. So yeah, I'll be back with you guys very shortly as soon as uh, I'm almost to Vegas, I guess. Because Vegas is going to be the, one of the next big stops. So I went to save my game and for some reason it decided to uh, freeze in the middle of saving it. So that means I'm going to have to end this episode here and I'm going to have to off camera go back and do everything I just did again. So it's about an hour of playing all over again. Um, no big deal though, I'll just do it all off camera again. Um, sorry for cutting this episode a little bit short. But, uh, yeah, gonna have to end it here. Hope you guys are enjoying it. Um, I was really looking forward to getting to New Vegas before the end of this episode. But that will have to wait for next time. Um, yeah, thank you guys. And please hit that like button for me. And if you're a new viewer, please subscribe. And I will see you dudes later.